We are pleased to present the first 50 clinical uses of the novel Luminae digital rectoscope in both the outpatient and perioperative settings. The device combines the point of care ease of use of rigid sigmoidoscopy with improved ergonomics and high definition imaging. The Luminae device has three main parts, the handpiece, the manifold, and the outer sleeve with introducer. Assembly is straightforward. The manifold is placed onto the handpiece and pressed to click. The outer sleeve with introducer is inserted into the patient. The introducer is removed. It is important to note that the sleeve is kept with the, with the lip pointing upwards. The handpiece can then be inserted and insufflation can commence once the manifold and air seal make contact. The device then mates with a positive click. Insufflation is achieved by compressing the bellows within the handset. This is easily done with one hand. Air can be released by ejecting the handpiece from the manifold, which is then easily reconnected. The manifold contains a three millimeter biopsy port through which forceps and snares can be passed. At the end of the procedure, the handpiece is removed from the manifold sleeve assembly and cleaned using the Tristol Trio wipe system. The manifold sleeve assembly and introducer are both disposed of in the clinical waste. The CHIP platform is a web-based, secure, encrypted service. Institutions have unique work environments and are responsible for issuing user accounts. The home page allows quick access to scoping, user management, clinic management, patient management and reports. Patient records are accessed from the Patients tab. Within each patient's record, you can access previous encounters with images and videos immediately available for review. Reports are completed on a standard template, which can then be printed or emailed as needed. Once you are within the patient environment, you can easily start a new scope session. Patients are typically examined in the left lateral position. Once the outer sleeve has been inserted rectally and the introducer removed, images are viewed on the tablet computer within the device's dock. The bellows integrated within the handpiece permit single-handed operation, with no stooping or peering down a clouded eyepiece needed. The 3mm working channel facilitates biopsies whilst a pneumorectum is maintained. The device and dock are portable and suitable for use across multiple clinical environments. The first 50 uses of this novel CE marked device were performed by 20 clinicians across 13 sites. 50 patients were included with a mean age of 60 years. Half of the assessments were for inpatients and half for outpatients. There was no significant difference in insertion distance between different bowel preparations and 13 biopsies were taken. A satisfactory clinical diagnosis was achieved in 48 out of 50 cases. Anonymized videos from 37 cases for which videos were recorded were analyzed independently by four consultant colorectal surgeons. A fair agreement was obtained on the view of the mucosa, the view of the vasculature, 
the ability to assess pathology, and the quality of bowel preparation. We believe that the Luminite is a safe device with multiple clinical applications. It introduces image capture and combines improved ergonomics and easier biopsy with the portability and low cost of conventional rigid sigmoidoscopy. Turnaround between cases takes less than five minutes. The device and computer pack away for easy portability to any clinical setting.